distended left upper quadrant view include the spleen, the kidney, diaphragm, and the spine. In this image here, we see an abnormal left upper quadrant because we see the ascites fluid marked by the red star. We see an enlarged spleen, the intestine, and a large liver. Let's go to the scanner. I'm going to show you how to obtain the standard left upper quadrant view. I am going to show you how to do the left upper quadrant view. Left upper quadrant view is a little bit more challenging than the other side because the kidney is more posterior and more superior. You put the probe at the 9th or the 10th intercostal space of the right upper quadrant view. And here we see the standard view is the kidney, the spleen, and the spine. A lot of times, the spleen like to hide high up in the rib cage where the rib shadow can be in the way. And then also, um, so you may have to put the probe more high up. And also sometimes you have to rotate to get away from the rib shadow. Same thing as the other side, you want to look around above the diaphragm, around the kidney, inferior and posterior, make sure that you look for fluid everywhere. So you go till up to look at the diaphragm, till down to look at the inferior area of the kidney. So that's the spleen, that's the kidney, the spine and the diaphragm. That concludes our left upper quadrant scan.